Hey, I'm Jim Weber in the Fox 13 Weather Center. Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. So we are done with Hurricane Sam. It made that transition into a post-tropical system. So we look at where we are in this season right now, September 10th being the peak of the hurricane season. We're now into October. We have that little dip in the activity, but as we get into about the second half of October, you see that little secondary maximum. We start to see a little bit more activity, kind of re-ramping back up a little bit. Certainly not what we typically see near September 10th, but the areas that we watch as we get towards that secondary peak is, it's really, it's the Gulf of Mexico, the Caribbean, and also into the Western Atlantic. We're not focusing further and further out into the Atlantic. Now, the one area that we're watching is over towards the Bahamas, north of the Bahamas, so Western Atlantic. Now, winds don't look like they're all that favorable that we're gonna see any development with this. And computer models really suggesting probably not gonna see a big increase in that favorability. It doesn't really look like it's gonna get a whole lot better, but it will continue to work its way on towards the north and the northwest. Eventually, looks like it'll start to interact with a frontal boundary that push, pushes off the east coast. So, those are those things you just have to watch because you get these old frontal boundaries, you get these interactions. If they hang out long enough, sometimes you see something developing. So here's a look at the GFS, and you see just that maybe that little hint of something uh, at least lower pressure, maybe a broad circulation in this area as we go, go towards the weekend. So at this point, really not seeing a whole lot of models jumping on board with any significant development with this. It's just one of those areas that we'll continue to monitor and see if things change as we go through the coming days. And of course, we'll keep you updated right here on MyFoxHurricane.com.